guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episode 21 of Delicious Party Pretty Girls. It's gotta get started in 3, 2, 1, go. I think, yeah, today we should be getting the new opening and ending from what I saw, like, late Saturday night while I was talking to my friends. Y'all don't know how hungry I am. I mean, when I was watching uh, the maid I hired recently as Mysterious, like, they were cooking something and that, and now, you know, food in this show. So, it's just going to be What's wrong? Uh oh. Oh. We should be getting more of the new, like, ending and such. Because everything still looks the same. They just added a money in it. Oh, that's different. You know, I thought they would have added her at that ending where, oh, hey, everyone's walking in. Hey, Yui! Are we serious? Like, I, I no, like, bruh? Exactly. There's somewhere else, but they're so cute. Oh my god.
Oh, that's pretty. The fact that we have to wait for the movie just to see the other two as humans as well. Oh. Oh, that looks so good. Only run. <laughs> yes. <laughs> That's why I feel like she is straight up. She's going to be a food critic. <laughs> Pretty. He's so cute, oh my god, I Yeah, I know. Shane does. You're getting a clue, like, right from her. you just thinking of other things. Yeah, you could tell. Oh, baby's having a fight. Oh, my God.
Yeah, but then what if it can't compete with all the other sweet shops and other departments that are coming out? And then eventually they're going to have to close even more. I'm honestly with Amani on this. Come on. Mm-hmm. Or maybe she just wants to go into the retirement. There could be many reasons on why she wants to go out and close the shop. <laughs> no, it's just complicated. <laughs> Mm-hmm. She's right.
I'm hungry. Like, I want food so bad right now. Like, ah. Uh, I need food. Hmm. Great. I saw for the simple care fans. So I'm like, yeah. I know you just can't leave. I mean, damn, that's tuxedo mask looking behind. You at least need to say something. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. 
tuxedo mask. <laughs> you know, <laughs> farewell. You didn't do anything. <laughs> like, yes, I helped. Helped with what today? You just saved her. You're right. Hmm? Uh, of course. Come in, come in. That was good. Mm -hmm. Ooh, th this episode gave me the feels and everything. Uh, just to also have an episode focused. Ah! Mm, look how pretty they look. I just want, we're, we're going to watch the ending and then we'll talk. I'm getting a lot of Alice in Wonderland type vibes from it. I mean, it, it's adorable. I love it. Like, it's so cute! That was cute. Oh my god. <laughs> Are we finally getting an episode all focused on him? Is it time? Like, mmm. But it still is an episode on him. Okay, I'm I'm here for it because see, this is what it, the, like future me and the way that they're going with this, and I, and I kind of you know maybe future me probably would agree with this. You know when we get to you know the end of the series, maybe I will agree, may um and such. But probably future me, you know maybe after this episode, despite seeing that preview, probably is not going to like how Toei does Black Pepper as a character and ish and I think that will probably be my biggest downfall about this show because I, I think a lot of us when we all first saw him we were all expecting him to still in a way be like a tuxedo mask like character but to be to like more elevated especially like if you are someone who has seen Sailor Moon like me like religiously even though I really am currently rewatching like the Viz dub, um, or well, rewatching the Viz dub for season one, season two, and then for season three to season five, like that'll be all brand new to me because I'm I've only seen clips of it. But regardless, it it's just like okay, this is what I want. This is what I 
want to receive on it. We're not kind of getting that. And we're already like 20 something, 22 officially as of this Saturday, 22 episodes into the series. And he is one of those characters that does not get the greatest moments or the great like times to shine except the previous episode that they had on him and now plus episode 22 this weekend so I'm really hoping that they develop him a little bit more and ish and kind of get the reason on why he's going to retire there's a lot of unanswered questions with him and with the mystery of both black pepper and cinnamon so hopefully in episode 22 a lot of things do get answered because you I don't want to go to the end of this show next year like January and going on to February and getting into the next Pretty Care series being like damn that was like you fucked up a character and even though I knew and was expecting them to fuck up on a character but the episode was good I love the fact that we got to have a Ron and Amane focused episode especially you know I got the Simpho gear feels I really did I like seeing those two interact just warmth my heart it just still brings me a little hope and a little freaking joy that you know Nanamizuki and Aoyuki will you know one day we'll have like the whole gang of every freaking Pretty Cure series all together and then Nanamizuki's character and Aoyuki's character can finally interact with these two and then plus you know we're missing like two 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 or three other girls from Sif yeah three it's three um Three other girls who need to be in Pretty Cure to officially complete that. So, fingers crossed. We pray that it happens. But yes, very sweet, adorable episode. I mean, like, uh, the feels, like, way too much. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode 21 of Delicious Party Pretty Cure. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially on Saturday, maybe even Sunday, for episode 22. Bye, guys.